Hi there, this is Ranjit and I have the Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge with me. And if you have been using the S6 or the S6 Edge and you use a lot of mobile data, you might have noticed that uh, the quick toggles for the mobile data just vanished on uh, many of the S6 and the S6 Edge devices. Uh, in fact, if you just go to uh, this edit, it'll show you all the quick toggles and you'll notice that we don't have any mobile data now. It was there earlier, but just it vanished. And this has uh, happened to a lot of people in uh, various countries. It's not just restricted to some regions. And uh, Samsung has actually acknowledged about this. So it's pretty irritating. Uh, quick toggle is a very good way to uh, switch on uh, and switch off mobile data. Uh, you can obviously go here uh, in the mobile data and switch it on and off in data usage here you can switch it on and off but it's a tedious uh, process and Samsung has acknowledged this bug and uh, they have a fix you can easily fix it you don't have to do anything special it's very easy and uh, you have to download a, a small app and just uh, uh, switch it on and it fixes but you have to download that app from the Galaxy apps so just go to this Galaxy apps and here you just need to search for quick panel toggle that is quick panel uh, sorry restore so this is the one you just search for this and it's made by Samsung and just just install it it's a small app it'll install pretty quickly you just accept this and again and you just hit open and you just hit this restore button and it says it's restored so now you can un just uninstall this app you don't need it so you will just uninstall it it's uninstalled now that uh, data quick toggle should be there if you go to edit uh, as uh, you can see the mobile data has come up so I'll just move it here uh, so this is a very e easy way to fix the mobile uh, data toggle that was actually missing so i hope this video is helpful uh, the android update 5.1 has also rolled out for the galaxy s6 and the s6 edge i did not get it yet uh, but i will i should be getting that one also very soon and i'll try to make an updated video about the changes with the 5.1 update also very soon so thanks for watching this video this is ranjit and i hope to see you in my next video